Hi all, how is everyone doing? Um, I wanted to do a daily vlog on how treatment is going for my HSCT in Mexico, stem cell treatment. Um, yesterday was the first day, um, they call it day minus 15. And the reason they call it day minus 15 is because on day zero, that's when you receive your stem cells back. So the first day it was fasting um, so that we could have blood tests. Lucky, lucky, I had seven vials of blood taken from me. Um, and then after that we had um, some other tests. So we went to have a chest x-ray. We also had an MRI. The MRI machine is fantastic. Um, I used Google Translate to find out what they'd written on their MRI poster. And um, they don't use radiology. They've got a new system which they use that takes the images. So it takes longer. I think it took um, an hour and 20 minutes and I had uh, my brain, the neck and lumbar taken. Um, but yeah, it was fine. Um, I didn't feel very claustrophobic, which was good. I don't normally with the MRI, but it was just weird because the sound was a lot different to what I'm used to. Um, so yesterday was a pretty long day. I think my driver, Javier, he's amazing. Um, he took me to, um, or took us as a group, to the mega store here in Mexico. So we got a few bits and bobs. Um, we also had a seminar. The seminar, um, we met 30 people that work within um, the clinic. So it's um, there are four different areas that are covered. Um, but three years ago, they used to have it all separately, and then the, the carer and the patient had to sort out their own food and sort out their own lodging and everything. But Clinica Ruiz in Mexico um, basically put all of them, combined them all together so that it's a one-stop shop. And it makes so much sense. The food here we get, we get three meals a day. It's amazing, both patient and carer. Um, very healthy, very nice and very accommodating. We have a two-bedroom suite, which is in the um, Clinica Ruiz building. Um, and it's all catered for disabled people. Um, if you don't have anything, you just ask them and they bring it over. So I asked for um, something to raise the toilet seat. I asked for um, a wheelie kind of chair that you can take in and out of the bathroom to help you get changed after. Um, and I asked for a frame, but I had a walker instead, um, which they then changed over and they got me one walker. So yeah, amazing service, it's great. The people here are lovely. The, the team of people just, they're willing to help you in every way possible. Um, so yeah, day one was over. Um, this is actually day two, which is minus day 14. Today, we didn't have to get up early, so we kind of got up leisurely, had a really nice breakfast. It was a vegan breakfast. Um, my sister-in-law would have loved it, and my brother. Um, yeah, so it was very tasty and very nice. Um, I don't know what's going on with my eyes today. Actually, since I've been here, they're so puffy and they've got lots of water retention. Um, anyway, so what was today? Today we are having to go to the building downstairs um, where we will see the neurologist and they will discuss my MR, MRI results, which I have to say, I had my MRI yesterday and the ten, within 10 minutes of it finishing, I had this big packet and it had my results in it. So yeah, amazing that they can pull it off so quick. Um, so we see him, and then uh, then we got given a gift by the team, which is a massage for an hour. So I'm going to go for a nice, relaxing massage. Um, and then when I come back, we've got to go to um, a hospital where we're going to see the echocardiology department and go and do some bits then. And I think we're free for the rest of the day. So, um, although it feels like a holiday sometimes, it's not. I start my chemotherapy on Friday. Um, there are some groups that have started today, and then another tomorrow, Thursday, and Friday. So I'm in group four, which is the last group. I wish I was in the first group, 
because then I could have gone first and got it over and done with. But um, never mind, I get to see the effects that other people have. It's either going to freak me out or I'm just not going to pay any heed to it. Anyway, that was my first and second day. So I shall keep you informed of the whole process. Bye for now.